All right, here we are. Which one is mine, gentlemen? Uh, the red? Like red? I don't mind red at all. Oh, no, no, you guys go. I'm good, but, but I appreciate it. Not lose the paddle. Oh, don't go overboard now. Almost lost my rod in the water. We are going to catch our first fish right over there. This is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to find a spot, drift past it, wade back up to it. Is that a fish? It is. First fish on the Q-bomb. Oh, and it's not a bass. It's a big old sunfish. Look at this. <laughs> Proof my Q-bomb works. Awesome. Look at that. Fat little aggressive. Whoop. Aggressive sunfish. Father's Day kayaking, guys. Sweet. Awesome. This is the perfect setup for a bigger fish, or multiple fish. We have rushing water here. We have a deep eddy over here where it undercuts the banks of these cypress trees. And there's something in the water in front of me, a log, a, a rock. We have an area over here that we can fish. You want to fish anything that's different in a situation like this. You want to fish the seams between the current and the slacker water. You want to fish everything like that. Bass fish I just caught was like right there above those roots. He just grabbed it. They hide underneath things like that, and they just grab food as it goes by. So let's make a cast. There's one. There's one. That was close. <laughs> There's a little fish. Eventually I'm gonna land one of these bigger fish that I'm hooking. I've lost the last three at least. But here we go. Beautiful little uh, long ear. Thank you. Hooked up with another one in the shade. Awesome. He's a little bigger this time. Oh, wait, it's a tilapia. Awesome. A real grande chiclet new species for the day these fish are awesome wait is something wrong with this one a rio grande chiclet beautiful little fish okay oh he's off but i caught him oh no way my line broke the fish fell in the water right in front of me but i was able to reach down and scoop him up for two reasons number one i want to get my lure back number two i want to show this fish off look at this fish what is this? It's some kind of a fungal infection, maybe. Oh yeah, it's covered with this. Maybe that's why he didn't dart away right away. Sorry you're sick, my bro. I mean, okay. That was a little strange. I'm not sure what. Caught in a spider web? Probably. Is that a fish? Oh, I don't think it is. I got it loose though. That's a fish. That's exactly where I thought he was gonna be. It's off. Damn it. He broke me off. Decent fish. 
Lost him on my homemade cue bomb. It is just so incredibly beautiful out here. Is that a fish? Do I have it? Yes, I do. I have a fish right on the edge of that current across there. Is it the first bass? It is not. It is, however, a another gorgeous long ear sunfish on the priority baits. Micro lure. Beautiful. Beautiful fish. Thank y'all for playing. All right, let's keep going down the river. Let's do it. right in front of me. That's a bar coming after it. And he has it. I got a gar. Hooked a gar. Hooked a gar. He might break the line, so. <laughs> I saw him. A little spotted gar. Oh, that's a show, bro. Nice. Oh, oh. I'll whack your beak on my thing here. Let me give myself some more line. I saw him. These things are nothing solid muscle. Look at this guy. I saw him along the edge. All right. Hundreds of little perch right here. God, this place is so pretty. Nope. Oh, I do have a fish. He might be our first bass. <laughs> he is so tiny. Well, it's our first bass of the day, though. A little guad, a Guadalupe, and he did like the Helgramite. Awesome. There you go. First bag. Yep, hooked up, hooked up. Is that a better fish? It's a little better fish, and it is a bass. Okay, as long as we keep upgrading every time, a little largey. So that's species number four, I believe. Again, find slack water or a current eddy, and catch fish. Whoo! Bro's got an attitude. There's another fish. Yes, another tiny little bassy. Ooh, one following him. <laughs> awesome, good jumper. I'll take it. The guad, oh my gosh. Oh, attitude, golly. You're gonna make the video just because of your, your attitude. Sweet.
There's a fish. On the micro. Put, look at the bend in that rod, though. Man. See? Oh, that's a beautiful fish. Look at this fat bad boy. Look at this dude. Beautiful fish. This is on the priority baits. Oh, Gilly. Ah, right on my balls. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Get off the balls. On the Gilly Swim 2 inch. This is about as white water as I want to get. Right here. There's a fish. Hey, a jumper. Not a big fish, but a pretty one. Look at this fatty. First real stick fish of the day. Not a bad catch. There's a fish. There's a fish right in the edge there. Not quite in the shade part, unless he come out of the shade. Oh yeah, beautiful fish. Look at this guy. All right, finally a fat little fish. He's short, but he's fat. Yikes. Short and fat. Awesome. Fun little catch though. Apparently there's a road right there. Above us. Oh, I hooked the fish. He was right up against that bluff wall. Right up against the bluff wall. What am I doing? Oh, yep, there we go. A fat little guad. There's a fish. There's a fish right there in that little corner in front of me. He may not make the video. He's not very big. He's a pretty one, though, brother. He's a pretty one. How's it going? Oh, great. Great day. There is no better place to be on a hot day uh, than right here. Oh, I'm soaked, but I love it. No monsters, but you know. I'm sure there are big ones, but I haven't caught one yet. The day is young. A little bass. They were nice. Whoop. Oh, some bougie cows. You got earrings. Okay. Okay. 
That's a better fish. Oh, look at that jump. Oh, he's off right by the boat. Nice. We got one on the rooster. Oh, it's a big old uh, red breast. Sweet. Big old red breast sunfish. Awesome. Switch to the rooster tail because I'm going to have to start going faster uh, to get to the takeout point by four. Awesome. A nice chunky one. Yay! Bye bye. Got a fish, got a fish. Got a fish back in that pocket. He's, he was tangled around that branch. Ooh, that's a big old sunfish. Yeah, big fat one. I don't mind catching you, bro. Big fat one. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, look at that. Gorgeous fish. Gorgeous. Getting fish slimed everywhere. Right, mega out fish slimed. Hmm. The hell is going on? A bass chasing. Any hook? Ha, I saw you. I saw you, bro. Oh, I'm you're wrapped around that branch right there. I saw you chasing minnows, I cast, and you fell for it, bro. All right, is he still on? He is not, of course.
Look at that. Look at all the dragonflies on that one lily pad. It's a dragonfly party. Oh, wait, they're doing something else. Never mind. A different kind of party. All right, we're almost to the takeout. So this is basically going to be the last. And there's a fish. All right. Can I land this final fish? It's a better. All right. Yes, get in the boat, bro. All right. Well, maybe this is it. The takeout is directly in front of us. You can't see it. It's a bridge up here. But what is fat Guadalupe bass? Wow. Beautiful fish. Right there along this edge. This is our last little spot. There's another one. There's another one. Ah, uh, lost it. There's a fish. There's one underneath this tree. Right there. Right there. We'll do the outro by the car. We had a good day on the river. Six hours of fishing. I mean, Father's Day Friday. Can't get better than that. All right, guys. Woo! It's a hot one, but what better way to spend a hot day, see what I did there, than on the river, just catching fish, having fun, and having an adventure. So, I mean, I don't even know what to tell you. This uh, was an awesome experience. Thank you to uh, TCK, I will post all of her stuff down below. She runs a shuttle and a $65 for seven hour kayak rental. And basically it's super easy. My car is right here at the exit and now it's time to head to the house, get some food. Tight lines, see you on the next one.